ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. Lemon fields it at the two. He's to the 20. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Second and 11 coming up now. Ball on their own 25. Set. Oklahoma. On the ground, left side. Tackle at about the 23-yard line. The offense knows that the linebackers are cheating up a little bit on the run. If they can get some protection. They might want to open up a little bit of space for some passes underneath. the 39-yard line. Well, the defensive line has to do a better job there of feeling that screen out. And a lot, a lot of times the offensive line will dictate whether or not it's going to be a screen pass or not. And when they feel and sense the offensive lineman releasing out to get out in front of the screen and to be able to try to make a play downfield, again, the defensive line is the key for any defense and being able to slow down the screen pass. From their own 39-yard line, first down. Down at the 37. Off the right side, doesn't get much. Good tackle. their own 37 yard line it's third down and he's leveled with the 27 yard line Coleman, the return man. And this one is a beauty. Coleman fields at the 29. He's tackled at the 46. Louisville's coaching staff so confident they know they've got a guy that's one of the best running backs in the country and that they can just play their game and not worry about the fact they're on the road. Well, Brett, his big play ability not only can give you big chunks of yards on the road, but more importantly, it can quiet this atmosphere and allow the quarterback in this offense just getting back and, and just being able to run and be able to communicate. And I think that's a big challenge for this team. So look for his big play ability to maybe even out the atmosphere and give this offense a chance to be able to execute. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 45. And he hits him hard at the 48-yard line. the 39-yard line and a nice pick up there I'll tell you what the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz and the quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man
from the 39-yard line. It's first down. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. Got it, complete, and he's out of bounds. From the 19 yard line. First down. Three down, three down. Mike 13, Mike 13. Winning! Nice run, and he's brought down. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. Concentration laps right there. The coaches will be giving them an earful for it, too. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. This one will fall incomplete. This just shows you that you don't need to be sacking the quarterback to disrupt the passing game. This is the eighth play of this drive. the middle for a nice game. Jordan comes away with five yards on the carry. That makes it 30 goal. So here it is, tie ball game, and we're on the one yard line. Third down. makes the PAT, an eight-play, 49-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. So the score now, 7-0. Louisville to kick. Branch fields it at the one. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. Louisville's really got things working right now for him. I can't think of a better start. Well, that's exactly the way they had hoped to see this game go. I mean, anytime you can start the game with a stop, get your offense out there, they move the ball down, put points on the board. Now it's just more about trying to maintain what they've already created. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Throws completely stopped immediately. They're about four yards away here on second down. They'll bring him down at the 31-yard line. Try and scramble. Runs with it, and he's got room. Slides down to the ground. The play was very well conceived as they were able to get a decent gain and a first down. We've got a first and ten. Ball on their own 44. They run left and he'll lose yardage.
fires out quickly to the tailback. He's tackled at about the 49. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. And he tackles him hard at the 43-yard line. So at the end of one, Louisville leads it 7-0. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. Let's go, let's go, let's go. On the ball, on the ball. Quick, quick, quick. Coleman awaiting the return. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Louisville is up a score. And they make the stop at about the 17-yard line. Well, you can really mess with an offense's game plan if you can take away their ability to run. their own 17-yard line. Second down. Incomplete. And that wasn't the greatest pass in the world. Well, I don't know how anybody can throw a great pass while getting drilled like that. This is definitely going to be pass interference. However, I'm not sure who they're going to call it on. They'll give this one another try after the flag. And on third down, too. That's when you don't want those kind of things to happen. The penalty digs them a big hole with third and long. made right around the 26-yard line. So the offense fails to pick up a first down. Hodges is waiting for the snap. He's taken down at the 33-yard line. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. On the ground, right side. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. There's nothing better than having an athletic, versatile, and instinctive safety. He makes a big-time play here with his recognition of the run, comes up and does what he does best, which is making a nice, short tackle on the ball here. From their own 31-yard line. Second down. Complete pass and hit hard as he came down with it. Flyers incomplete, knocked away. Now, who's the penalty going to be called on here? Pass interference. Offense. He threw that to a guy who was well covered, and it almost got intercepted. Yeah, he's very lucky. That ball was only tipped. They've got 10 guys up. It looks like they're going to try to block this one. at the 30-yard line. Louisville staff, you, you've got to think they're going to be happy. They're almost here at halftime. 
They've got the lead, and their main guy's not playing very well. Well, to think that they have this lead without him playing well, I think, is a testament to the way they've approached this week. You know, he's he's eventually going to catch fire. And I'm sure as they uh, talk uh, to one another at halftime, they're probably not going to get too far away from the game plan. Continue to utilize your star player and hope that the others continue to play well in the second half. Gain of 19 yards. It's first and ten. Ball on the 49-yard line. Three down, three down. Louisville up seven points. They'll run it. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. And they finally knock him out at the 24-yard line. From the 24-yard line, first down. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. Nice throw to hit the out route against man coverage for a first down. So they're going to try to determine if the receiver had possession and was in bounds or not. They call it a catch, but the boots signal down to the referee that they'd like to take another peek at this. Man, as I see this play again, it really looks like he made the correct call on the field. After review the play, the ruling on the field stands. After review, they decided that the call on the field will stand. Taken down right around the 10 yard line. Second down and seven. Ball on the 10 yard line. And down he goes around the two yard line. Getting him the ball in the passing game creates real havoc for the defense. There aren't many linebackers who can stay with him in coverage, that's for sure. Looks to a receiver, touchdown! And he hits the PAT. So a six-play, 71-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. So our score, 14-0. all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 26. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. quick to the receiver and it falls incomplete from their own 26 yard line it's second down the Trojans wide receiver out with an apparent injury although he might make a comeback later in this game caught open field tackle at the 32 these short effective passes are going to help the quarterback's confidence About four yards away here on third down. Four down, four down. 24 is the mic. Set. Up the left. Throws complete. He's got room to work. Brought down right around the 42-yard line. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back the pass. Tackle. 
tackle after a decent run up the gut. Second down and six. Ball on the 46. He makes it to the 48-yard line. You got to give the receiver a chance to make the play. That was just underthrown. That makes it fourth and four. Coleman will be the return man. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Louisville's done what they had to do offensively. They've done a nice job here in the first half, partner. Boy, it's been very consistent for them, and consequently, they have a nice lead here going into halftime. But again, they've got to be able to do a nice job here of continuing to fight because this offense that they're facing across the line of scrimmage on the other side of the ball, they can score in a hurry. So there's still a lot of football to be played. Fires out to his receiver. That's a great tackle at the 26-yard line. About six yards on that completion. It's a decent pickup that time on a well-designed play. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. And he hits him hard at the 32-yard line. First down. middle got his back he's taken down at the 38 louisville will take their second time out of the half they're about four yards away here on second down at the 30 completes it across the middle and he's tackled right around the 22 yard line Just throws this one away. From the 22-yard line, second down. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. They'll bring him down at about the 11. That makes it first and ten. Throws it in a hurry, and he's tackled right away. Puts it right in his hands. Touchdown. He makes the PAT. So that's an eight play, 79 yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. The score now, 21 0. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He's to the 20. He's tackled at the 29 yard line. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Fires out to his wideout. He's tackled around the 42-yard line. That one's more than good enough for the first down. Well, Brad, that is a great play by the quarterback to find his target past the marker to keep this drive moving. Caught out in the open, and they make the stop at the 46. Pretty nice pickup here. 
These guys are getting very tight on their timing. It's second down, six yards to go. Ball on their own 46. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. And it's almost picked off. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. at right side got him again what a play and that'll set up a first and goal USC will take their last time out it's first down and they'll be looking for six points here kicks away and it is good we've reached halftime and I don't think too many people were expecting this Louisville's up by 18 we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Ball security was a major theme coming into this game, and both offensive coordinators have to be thrilled with the fact that their offenses, first and foremost, did a good job of taking care of the ball. And you don't see it every game, that's for sure, that both teams don't have a turnover at the half. And you usually see those critical mistakes that set up a short field for you to take advantage of. And, and it's definitely nice. It's nice to be able to put in a plan all throughout the week and to be able to execute it and not to be able to make those big mistakes. Because coaches will tell you, it's those big mistakes that kill you. It's okay to be rushed in the pocket as a quarterback and then throw it to your mom in the third row. Don't throw it in harm's way. Both quarterbacks done a good job, and as a result, both teams with zero turnovers in the first half. Just about time to get you back out for the second half. Brad and Kirk will be along in just a second. You looking forward to keeping an eye on everything around the country here? Got a good, a good game score. We're locked and loaded. We got all the big screens going. You're going to be looking to hand out some helmet stickers later? Yeah. We're loaded, man. I'll try. You think you can keep on your shoes in the second half? I'll try to. They stinky? <laughs> yes. Brad and Kirk, you're at a safe distance. Take it away. All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. He sends this one deep. He's to the 20. They'll bring him down at the 23. Well, this offense has found the end zone on their last two drives, and they're coming out on this one trying to do much of the same. Jordan gets the call, gets to about the 24-yard line. That brings up second and nine. From their own 24-yard line, it's second down. Passes left, going the other way. Inside the 30. The 10. Tackle made just outside the goal line. Hey, this could potentially turn this football game around. They're down by a couple scores, but if you're the offense and you're on the sideline and you're not feeling good about yourself and your defense comes up with an interception like that, boy, oh boy, you're grabbing your helmet and sprinting on that field and you're ready to go. First down. So inside the five with a first and goal. They're not done yet. It is a really reliable weapon. You definitely want the football in his hands near the end zone, and he showed you why right there. Seems like ultimately they weren't quite sure what was coming at them, and they gave up the score. And he adds the extra point. Lynch is lined up to kick this one off.
He'll return it from the one. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 26. The offense will take the field, hoping for a better result than their last drive. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I would be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. He goes out of bounds right around the 30. It's second down, six to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's a gain of five on the play. That'll make it 31. There's a strike complete. And he's tackled in the open field. From their own 40-yard line, it's first down. Receivers got it on the screen. And he's taken down right around the 46-yard line. That'll make it second and four. Around the 43 yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 43 yard line. He goes downtown. Keeps a foot in and pulls it down. That makes it first and goal. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Tackled for a loss. Not much there on the screen play. And this play is number eight on the drive. At the one. Not a bad little play there. Yeah, this is a nice job by the quarterback reading the coverage and delivering a very catchable ball and allowing his receiver to come up with a nice game. Third and goal. Ball on the one. And he's level at the one yard line. So he decides to hold on to it, and that's going nowhere. Kick is up, and he got it. Looks like they're ready for the kick. From his own goal line, he's to the 20, and he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He makes it to the 25-yard line. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. down at about the 41. Nice throw to hit the out route against man coverage for a first down.
first and ten. Ball on the 41 yard line. Pass incomplete. Trying to get it to his receiver. That makes it second and ten. Lloyd on the delay. Makes it out to about the 49. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. Very good tackle in space. First and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. He's taken down at the 24. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. down, 10 to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. And he's tackled right around the 16-yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. three yards to pick up the first down. Screen pass. He's got his half back. Big play, and it's first and goal. Tenth play of the drive. up in the pocket and sacked. From the 16-yard line, second down. Ten. We played three, and this is not what the experts predicted. 24-10, Louisville. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Mike 22, he's coming, 22, he's coming, Mike, Mike. Come on out here, come get some. Come get some. We're still early in the fourth quarter, but that was a huge stop, and now with the lead, they're going to get the football back and an opportunity to stretch the lead. So the offense stays on the field to attempt this fourth down from the six-yard line. The halfback with a carry. Touchdown, USC! A powerful push by the line and a really nice run. 
That'll get you into the end zone almost every time. And he hits the PAT. It was a 13-play, 76-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. Fred, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. Jordan from the one. Oh, what a hit. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. Brad, with this offense having the lead, you know they're going to work with some clock. You know they're probably going to be conservative. It's a good opportunity for this defense to take some chances, pin their ears back, try to get aggressive, and try to get the football back. A five-yard gain. Here's a safe play hitting the underneath receiver, but it's a nice gain of five. from their own 30-yard line. Second down. Louisville is up seven. They go with the screen here, and the halfback's got it. He's gobbled up in the backfield. tailback. They'll bring him down at about the 27-yard line. Loss of two. Pretty good stand there. They weren't fooled at all by the offensive play call. Hodges to punt. He makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. He did a good job there to give his team decent field position. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. He's tackled around the 45-yard line. They get a one-yard loss on that one. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated him there. From their own 45-yard line, it's second down. Makes the grab and steps out right away. Seven yard line. First down. They go to the back and he's hit immediately in the backfield. Pickup from the 32 yard line, third down. And they make the stop right around the 20. Made 
It's second down and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Here's the halfback. Nice run up the middle. And that's their third first down of the drive. The defense needs to figure out a way to stop them or else they're going to have no problem putting points on the board. This is the eighth play of this drive. Less than three minutes in the game. And he's taken down at the four. We've got second and goal. Four yards out. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Pressure got to him, and it's picked off. And that is an absolutely huge turnover for this defense. They couldn't have picked that off at a better time. Just a horrible decision by the quarterback trying to force that pass, especially at this point in the game. Fires it out. And down he goes at about the 23-yard line. Personal foul. Basement. Defense. Concentration laps right there. The coaches will be giving them an earful for it, too. From their own 38-yard line. First down. throw and he's got the halfback again tackle right around the 44 yard line six yards that time on the pass play well he really didn't have to do too much there to give himself a little room to make the catch gains his way to the 43 yard line it's great when a running attack comes through for the first down like this it makes an offense so much more versatile less than two minutes in the fourth quarter He makes his way to about the 32. Brad, you just don't see this very often anymore in college football. That is their fifth first down on this drive alone. They have great rhythm right now as an offense. And look at that poor defense. They're looking over the sidelines for the defense coordinator for some help. They need to change things up. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. And he's brought down there by the senior at linebacker. That won't be the last time today we'll be talking about this young man. Second and 10. Ball on the 32. Tackled after positive yardage. Ball again, four yards. Third down. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Give to the tailback. Gets to about the 27 yard line. So that's going to do it. Our final score in this one, 24-17, Louisville. And the Trojans, 17. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.